Baker Park has long since been where you go to find the cool and trendy spots in Chicago. So if you're going to be a bar or restaurant, you really have to prove your worth if you're going to remain a hot commodity on the scene. The 5050 has been a go-to in Wicker Park for over eight years now, and they've just completely revamped their menu and decor to elevate the sports bar experience. So let's take a peek inside and see what they did. The 5050 group's dynamic duo of Scott and Greg has overseen many successful bar and restaurant concepts in Chicago, but the 5050 is their namesake, so it holds a special place in their heart. Okay guys, tell me about how you came up with the concept of the 50-50 originally. We were both working in, in fine dining and we'd find ourselves, every night, getting off work and going to a sports bar or going somewhere to, to, to have uh, a beer and some wings. And so as time went on, we decided to do our own place. That's what we wanted to do. So not only have you redesigned the entire space, but you've also updated your menu and your drink program a little bit. So tell me about that guys. Sure. You know, when we first opened, we had a very ambitious menu for us, and we saw things that maybe our clientele was ready or not ready to try, but after nine years of being in the restaurant industry and developing a good reputation for our food, today we're able to do some things, finally, in this concept that really kind of once again, push the boundaries for what you can do inside of the sports bar. Now you've completely revamped it and have done this amazing, huge overhaul. So tell me about that. Thank you. Well, we, we've learned a lot over the last eight or nine years. Um, and a lot of that went into this design. We wanted it to be a little bit more comfortable. Uh, every table has its own TV if you are here for the games. Um, brighten and it up a, big a little TV bit. Big TV too. Big TVs, yeah. you're not gonna miss anything. You're gonna exactly. see everything. Um, but you know, just make it more approachable, a little bit lighter, um, a little bit more friendly. And uh, yeah. Really just set the trend for what design should look like in an upscale sports bar. Operating partner Eddie Mahoney is the backbone that keeps the 50-50 running smoothly. Okay, Eddie, I was just talking with your partners inside. We talked a lot about food earlier, but I want to hear about the bar program. So tell me what's going on with you guys now. Well, just like the revamp, we decided to uh, step our game up with our cocktail program as well. Okay. We've got a lot of higher end whiskeys, which that we decided with the changing of the neighborhood and what our clientele wants to give them what they want. You guys have a huge whiskey selection. Yeah. Um, How many are on the list? There's like... We've got about 32. Wow. So yeah, we've got, uh, we've got some good stuff. So now what have we got going on here? Because this is definitely unique. This is part of our snow machine program. So basically okay. we have a snow machine that we bought. Snow machine? That is one of two in the nation, I believe. So it- Are you kidding? It is realistically snow that we infuse alcohol into. And it comes out as alcoholic snow. So what you're drinking right <laughs> alcoholic there- Alcoholic snow. <laughs> what you're drinking right there is called our Frosé. So our Frosé is a- uh, it's a rosé, still rosé. And you're eating it. You're not even really yeah. drinking it. I you mean, can this eat is it or thick. drink it as it as it melts a little, but it does change mm -hmm. flavor a little bit as it melts. And it doesn't taste like a. It doesn't have the consistency of a typical slushy, where it's like rough and coarse. It's actually really smooth and creamy almost. Yeah, the the, the cream on the top is a, is a chartreuse whipped cream that we that we do in house as so well. Just so just the whipped cream slash garnish alone will like get you hammered. As you can see, the 5050 is much more than your average neighborhood sports bar. And whether you're actually a neighbor or you're gonna drive across town to come here, you'll be able to dine and drink in this updated venue that's literally raised the bar.